Hello, my name is Blair and welcome to another Linux app. Today we will take a look into the thumbnails that is not showing into your Linux desktop. So I have this few days or few weeks ago I installed this Linux OS which is our KDE Neon 5.27 Plasma desktop environment and I'll show you I don't have any thumbnails right here even in my native right here so I don't have any right here right so how do you put a thumbnail into your videos or in pictures do I have pictures right here yeah pictures are already okay because it is a picture so they have the thumbnail as it comes so how about in the video I go to my Ubuntu and go to my videos and some of them are not showing most of them are not showing especially mp3 and all those stuff videos that I have so how do you uh, install so I came across this website which is I'm trying to to help people especially the first newcomers or uh, first timers uh, Linux user and of course by doing this research you can always look for the answers for example this one dolphin not showing video thumbnails so I came across this page and click on it and I do my research and do the thing you know go to the general configuration yes it is here and preview and there is no preview for videos only pictures hmm how can we do this one so of course I scroll down and and of course I saw this one FF MPEG thumbs which means it is the video thumbnails for the MPEG or the MP that is why MP MP4 for video so you need to type in this as you came to that conclusion we are going to our terminal yes you can use terminal without any scary thing I don't know if it is already available into our discover let's go to FF MPEG thumbs click enter so we have this so it's up to you which is which are you comfortable if you are comfortable in just type into the console or the text terminal or you can always use the software downloader so it's up to you if you want to uh, install apt install ffmpeg thumbs something like that and you click enter and of course if you want you use this one method one or method two it's up to you so I prefer not to use the text terminal because sometimes for the other people they are scared because we have the implementation of to be scared <laughs> <laughs> okay so anyway let's uh, download the FF MPEG thumbnailer let's click install and then of course you enter the super secret password of course don't forget your password okay it is short it is okay if it is long it's up to you but I recommend if you are just using it for your personal thing your personal laptop uh, personal desktop at home just click and enter just short uh, password 
if you are using it in the office of course you need to have a, a little bit long but I prefer a short password sh should be if you are an average user okay because I'm sharing this for the newcomer in Linux and our first look for the newcomer to use Linux as their daily driver so let's enter and it is downloading and ta-da! it's finished so let's try to see if we could uh, refresh this one should I yes it is already finished yay so you can see the we have the thumbnail already so it is very easy you don't need to go to a text terminal just to enter the code but you can always go to the software center and look for the thumbnailer okay thumbnail oops thumbnail just click the one and you uh, have this thumbnailers image thumbnails or video thumbnails so video thumbnails generator so you have to go through this and then click install of course if you want to remove whoa wait why should I remove it oh anyway <laughs> just click install okay and if you have some problems feel free to ask me and I'm really really eager to help you to help you with your Linux experience so that's it for now for our Linux app the FF MPEG thumbnailer this is Blair for your Linux app catch another episode of Linux app and all of, most, all of my stuff about computers, Linux, especially in Linux, and science. And remember that science means knowing, because science is cool. This is Blair saying bye for now and see you in the next episode. Ciao!